Today is day five of my water fast and it was definitely challenging. The first day was actually the easiest, believe it or not. I had no food cravings. I did have some hunger pains around noon, but that's usually whenever I would start eating because I have been intermittent fasting for a while and that's when I would have my smoothie. So it makes sense as to why I did get the hunger pains around noon and then, you know, a little bit throughout the day. I remember actually feeling tired and like just pain under my bags the first day as well around 3 p.m. But other than that, everything was positive results. I was clear focused. I had lots of energy. I was able to work all day without being like too drained. The tiredness happened in between my shift whenever I was like sitting down. The second day I did feel pretty good as well. Um, I was able to work seven hours all the way until midnight and I again had lots of energy throughout the day. It was pretty good, um, clear focus, but I remember I actually wasn't as clear in my mind with my thoughts as the first day because I remember I was just very in the present moment and I didn't even think about the past, I didn't think about the future. I was just like always focused on my tasks in hand. And on the second day it was a little bit of like fogginess but I was still able to make it through you know doing daily things and then day three hit and I felt completely horrible but I do remember people saying that the third day is always the worst so I took that into account and I'm like yeah you know what like it's gonna be fine day four day five like I'll feel great so, you know, I can handle this, but I was literally like bedridden, tired, headache, nose was running. I couldn't even really talk. I didn't even have that much energy. Um, <laughs> yeah, it was like pretty bad. I remember like I went out for about an hour, but then I came back in and I still wanted to do things around the house, like clean and, um, you know, do basic things, but I couldn't even do that. So I still made it through and I'm like, you know what, like day four, I'm going to wake up and I'm going to feel so good. I woke up day four completely worse than day three. Like it was really, really bad. Um, yeah, just like I couldn't even get out of bed for like until like 11 or 12. And both of those days I actually slept so long. Like definitely my body is detoxing and healing because I literally went to bed at like 9 or 10 um, I think one night 10 30 but I literally slept until 9 a.m. the next day I literally just like let my body rest so I know that there is still some little things my body needs to heal um, and I still push through the day even though it was so hard it was so <laughs> It was so hard. I literally could not even talk. Like my energy levels were so low. It was so bad. Like I literally, like that was the day I couldn't even do anything. Like I couldn't do anything. <laughs> so now today is day five and um, I f didn't feel as good as day two, but I definitely felt better than three and four when I woke up this morning. And I had somewhat energy. Um, I was able to you know like get ready it took so much longer like literally more hours than it would to do just a simple task but I finally like got my way out I went to the grocery store got some food and made a green juice so that's what I broke my fast with and it was celery cucumber lemon a little bit of apple and parsley so that, I remember drinking it and it felt, it just tasted so good. Like whenever you do not eat anything for five days, you really appreciate <laughs> food and the palate of your tongue changes. So when you taste the first juice of a green juice, you are just so grateful and thankful. You're like, thank the Lord. <laughs> so after, um... I did that I felt better and I did have some more energy and now I am feeling better as well and I was able to exercise 
I'm like yesterday and now I'm gonna have one more juice before the night's over it's about 4 30 almost 5 so I'm gonna get that down and I'm just gonna continue on to this juice fast now um but more talking about the water why I'm doing a water fast is because it heals your body on a cellular level eventually whenever you knock the food source out of your body um, it goes into ketosis so your body either runs on glucose or ketosis glucose which is sugar which is in basically like almost every single food <laughs> like bread pasta cereal like chocolate like everything not good especially refined fruit uh, sugar is good because of the natural sugar but not all that processed junk so then you go into ketosis which that is when your body is burning off your fat cells and it kicks into your brain and that's why like you are able to focus and do things and have lots of energy so then on the third day your body goes into autophagy which is deep cellular healing and that's probably why I felt like complete shit day three and day four and a little bit of this morning um but you know you just like power through it it's like anything it's like running a marathon you know some days you're sometimes throughout the marathon like you're gonna feel like crap but then you know like if you just power through it eventually you're gonna feel good and that's basically like fasting like almost anything in life um it's just all about the journey and you know really <laughs> embracing the pain because it is your body healing so yeah now I'm gonna put myself to drinking green juices and I don't know how long I'm gonna do that because it is winter in Canada it was literally minus 34 with the windshield yesterday and it was disgustingly cold all weekend um I did go out and get some produce but again like none of it is organic because organic is super expensive and um produce in general is just crappy right now because like, you have to import it throughout the whole entire world and it's winter it just kind of sucks to be honest but i mean even though i may be juicing some like pesticides and like gross things right now <laughs> and chemicals like sprays I am like washing my produce with vinegar and baking soda letting it soak and then I'm juicing it so I don't really know how long I'm gonna do it for because yeah it is like quite expensive but it's way better than just like going and like eating food right now because <laughs> your body literally takes 80% of 80% of its energy into digesting food. So just like imagine like without digesting food, you just have all this energy. And with green juices, you're literally sucking all of the nutrients in through a straw into your body and your body isn't digesting, but it's still absorbing all those nutrients. So you're still able to, you know, work and um, do whatever you need to do during the day. So I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna go into phase three. And I'll update you guys on that in the future, but I just really wanted to share my experience on this five day water fast. And maybe I'll put a couple of little clips in just to show you guys <laughs> my energy levels because it is crazy. Like you literally see the difference in every single day. Um, like how I literally just almost deteriorate. <laughs> I strip my body down and it's crazy. So you guys can take a look here. And no, I did not cheat. I just wanted to mention that because what would be the point of that of making a video and then like cheating, I would only be cheating myself and my body and I wouldn't even be self accountable for all of the hard work I did. So yes, I'm going to keep moving forward and doing this because I know it's the right thing to do and I am proud of myself and excited to see how I will be in the future.
So thank you so much and I'll see you in the future.